Well, howdy folks. I am out camping again with the hammock. I'm on the island of Hergsora. And uh, I'll be camping by the sea hopefully later on. The island is inhabited all year round. And so there is a ferry that goes several times a day, every day of the week. Uh, it's free as well, the ferry, for both traffic, car traffic and for pedestrian travellers, which is a great service. As the sign says, Farmore's Café. Farmore is your grandmother. It is literally your father's mother, Farmore. And Velkommen Tervetola is welcome in Swedish and Finnish. This um, is going through there and it's in a nice white house in the yard inside. And uh, the restaurant is famous for making really, really nice food. I've been there a couple of times uh, because I've been working in this area. And uh, they use really good seafood and also they use local produce like uh, beef, dairy, poultry. And uh, yeah, the food here is. Okay, we're here. So uh, there's a few people here with tents and with hammocks. But uh, I only had to walk maybe a couple of hundred meters up shore, up the shore from the beach to find a suitable hammock site. So I've got my trees, no widow makers, and I am literally 30 meters away from the water. Okay, so we're all packed up and heading off. I had, a, had an interesting experience. The, there was a couple of Spanish staying beside me in a tent with their dog, and uh, they were preparing breakfast. And uh, the lady started screaming, and it was, she said there was a snake. So I went to have a look at it, and uh, yeah, it turns out it was a a skink, a legless lizard, quite long, maybe 20, 20 centimeters, 25 centimeters long, uh, but definitely not a, an adder because those are the ones that will, you know, give you a venomous bite. So this is one of the big windmills that are turning here on this island of Högsora. They're extremely tall and as such it's easy to see why they can be used as a landmark for people traveling at sea. You can probably hear the blades whistling as they as they spin. You could hear this every now and again. Uh, last night when I was in the hammock, and uh, yeah, this is strangely, strangely calming sound. I didn't take the underquilt with me this time. Instead, I found a mat that can go into a hammock. In fact, it's specifically designed for a hammock. It's from Climate. It's called the Climate Insulated V or Insulated Hammock V, something like that. It has these funny wings on the side that when inflated uh, it keeps the mat better in place. a fantastic trip really really enjoyed that uh, being warm and being able to sleep were two massive bonuses and uh, yeah really added to the whole pleasure of the of the experience so thank you for joining me on this video I uh, hope you enjoyed it 
uh, leave a like or a comment down in the comments if you want to do it I would appreciate it and uh, yeah I'll catch you on the next trail all the best bye bye